Hello everybody, welcome back. This is live coverage of round seven of the 41st Chess Olympiad. The final part of today's coverage and what a day we've had. Some amazing results. I'm with Jan Gustafsson again, but perhaps more importantly, we are joined by the King Slayer, the man who toppled the world champion. Can't remember the last time he lost with White, I have to admit. Yeah. It's been a while, that would be a nice little stat to know, but delighted to have Arkady Nadic with us. Hello. Congratulations. Thank you. It's a massive result, really. Yeah, of course. Uh, there is no bigger result, great, yeah. right? Than, right. Beating, uh, than beating Magnus with Black. Tell us about how you feel, the game, the, uh, we can go through the game, the critical moments. Mm -hmm. But I think uh, all in all, uh, I think I have to say I've been uh, maybe as lucky as uh, usually Carlson is. <laughs> Uh, he was, uh, let's say, very lucky yesterday to win uh, his game against Caruana. He was just yes. doing much worse. Uh, and of course, uh, my position was really tough today first. Mm -hmm. uh, then it got very complicated and uh, in time trouble, it was a little strange to me, but he started to panic. Um, he never panics. It's, uh, yes, he got very nervous. Um, so it was a little bit strange to see him so nervous and uh, then I took my chances. And, uh, you did? Yeah. Should we go to this first go critical moment? Through the key moments. Yeah. The first, this is a well-known theoretical line. You played the move knight e4, which at least for us came as a surprise for you as well. Uh, yeah, I mean, I did not expect uh, that he will play me this line, of course. Uh, mm -hmm. Knight e4 is a very rare move. Uh, I saw it before, but it's, of course, nothing to what you prepare. Right. So I think uh, bishop a6 was correct. Uh, Queen c2, but I think now I, I made a mistake, h6. Um, I should have played uh, bishop e7 uh, immediately. Mm -hmm. Because now he, he can't play a3 because always c5 is coming. Uh. It's very important not, mm -hmm. of course, to allow the b4 mm -hmm. move. So basically I made a blunder uh, here when I played h6. I thought uh, that he can't play uh, a3 before. So he played a3, bishop e7 before. I just thought uh, it's not possible because of bishop take before. And, and now the trick is, yeah. if in case of bishop h6 and bishop c3, uh, all, all is good, I think. I'm yeah. fine, but he can take just a take before, yeah. queen take a1, and now yeah. knight d2. I don't know if I calculated right, but I was afraid yeah. of knight d2. Yeah. Oh, no, 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 not here, not here. Bishop b2. No, bishop b2, yes, yes, yes of course, of course, yeah. Queen a2 and now knight d2. That's cute. Actually, not so easy to find this move, knight d2, because... Uh, Otherwise, I think black is fine, but this knight d2 is really killing. And if knight takes b4, just queen, queen c3. c3. Yeah, that's great. So you have so to you settle for queen, queen b5. B5. Uh, yes, of course, I'm doing clearly worse here. I mean, it's out of question. So I think he played well. I mean, normal rookie one, queen b2. I think I have to go for c5. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, I'm doing very badly with my structure. And uh, I think here, oh, I had some doubts if I should take just on c5. Uh, I mean, it's just a um, slightly unpleasant position, mm -hmm. but it's clearly unpleasant with a bishop pair. White mm -hmm. is doing very comfortable. Yeah. Especially Carson, I think he likes such things uh, to push for nothing. <laughs> so I decided to play bishop f6, um, queen a2. And I think uh, here I took as well not such a good decision to play rook a c8. I think uh, knight c3 might have been a try. No, knight, knight c3, I don't know. If, if bishop a1, just queen a1. Yeah, this is looking really and bad. This is a threat, yeah? mm -hmm. so. uh, I think knight c3 uh, was maybe a try. Queen c4, bishop c4, bishop a8, and then just to take rook a8. Maybe it was the best I could have done. Mm -hmm. It's not so easy for white uh, yeah. to, uh, to make a move. Yeah. I thought uh, during the game that maybe bishop b2 is the best. Uh, I was not sure. Uh, but I think bishop b2, uh, knight e2, take, take, take f6, and now, for example, f4. Yeah. So I thought uh, it might be like uh, plus equal. Or but you've got chances to hold Yes, here, yes. Right? I, th I thought, um, yes, it might have been the best what I could have done. I should have went for knight c3, mm -hmm. I think. I was oh, thinking for half an hour here, I was not sure if I should play knight c3. Uh, yeah, I made... Uh, really stupid decision to play here, rook ac8, I think it's after e4, it's already quite bad. So it takes, takes, this is all forced, takes, takes, and e5 is... Bishop e7. Bishop e7. I think, uh, okay, it's maybe a little bit better for black than it's looked like. Mm -hmm. 
it looks like just a pawn down, but I think I have some practical chances because uh, I want this to cover the d5 square somewhere and uh, try to escape. Uh, I mean, bishop d5, exchange the bishops, or knight d5, then, then a5. So yeah, I think I have some practical yeah. chances to, to escape here. Uh, personally, I was a little bit surprised by his move, bishop d2. I don't know. Bishop e3 was, three was the move that we just thought. Yes, I also thought bishop e3 is... Uh, and you're in trouble here, yeah? With no, I mean, of course, I'm clearly worse. It's yeah. out of question, yeah. Yeah, I was surprised he played bishop d2, because it allowed this... Uh, yes, because now after knight e2, knight d4, yeah. the things are... I mean, I'm still worse, but it's getting complicated, yes. because I'm putting the bishop on d5, and I have always good counter chances. So, rook ac1, you play bishop d5, and mm -hmm. then... Takes, takes, and again here. Yeah. Knight d7. No, but I think uh, knight d7 is, it was well played. Yeah, it's a good move. Okay. Yeah, because otherwise I want just to take bishop takes c5, and uh, I think I have good chances to make a draw. So make a draw. Okay, so. I was not sure. Maybe rook c1 was not the best. Maybe rook fd8 is uh, a better rook move. Rook fd8 here. Yeah. Okay, it's hard to say. Rook c8, rook c8, rook c1, and now maybe I can take rook takes c1 and somehow try to escape. I was not sure. So it takes, takes. And rook c1. Now it's a question if I have a better move than rook d8. I was not sure if I, after rook takes c1, I thought that probably there is no escape because bishop takes c1, knight b3, and bishop b2. Mm -hmm. I think it's just a lost position. d4, king g2, and I think. Uh, Comes in time, yeah? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So rook takes c1 and rook d8. Yeah, but it's the same like in the game. Yeah, I took yeah first. It's the same, yeah. It's it's just, yeah. Uh, yeah. Right, C5. yeah, but now the position is quite tricky. I think. I've, yeah. Um, yeah. I think you did well to. Uh, here we started to wonder all of a sudden. It's not so easy for White to find a square for this bishop. No, I think uh, Magnus uh, missed uh, G5 move because. Mm. G5. Is an otherwise, uh, position is looking. Close to winning, I, th I think after d4, king g2, I can't escape in this rook in game. Yeah, we were looking at <coughs> this knight g5 but bishop here, d2 no. some chances. Yeah, I d2. thought it's very bad, rook, rook c2. Yeah. Just rook b2. Yeah, king is coming. I think there is no escape. Mm. G5, excellent move, really. At least from practical point of view, I think g5 was uh, the right decision, because we were getting both sh short on time mm -hmm. and... Uh, it was a little bit strange to see Carlson getting a little nervous. So. There was here he was getting nervous. Uh, uh, yeah, no, but uh, I mean, uh, the way the game uh, went, of course, mm -hmm. he was just a pawn up uh, and very comfortable end game now. There are big complications. Um, of course, he was not happy. I think it was this bishop d2 move. I think that's the, I think that's the key error by Instead Carlson. Of bishop e3, Instead yeah. of bishop b3, yeah, because <coughs> then all of this knight d4 stuff never works and you're, you're compact and consolidated. I don't know. Okay. Yeah. So h3, h5, so you've got the knight consolidated on g4, on f3, sorry. Now I was not sure if rook d7 was actually the right move. Um, maybe d4 was a better one. Mm -hmm. I thought uh, bishop a5, rook d7. And now, transposes, right? uh, yeah, but now he has also e6 move. Rook take h5. Wow. A super crazy position. I mean, I, uh, maybe after d3, h take g4, d2 is close to draw. I think white can try a little, but uh, I think it should be a draw. A lot of pawns, mm. yeah. Yeah, looks to be a draw. Maybe it would have been better move order to play d4 immediately. Mm -hmm. Because after rook d7, he, uh, he got this chance to play rook c8, because I don't have king g7, yeah, of course, because of e6. Oh, e6 yeah. So now, bishop a5, yeah. No, it's actually quite tricky. Uh, I had little time, I was not sure, in, as well here, playing d4, maybe just knight take e5 should lead to about an equal position, I thought. Uh, quite complicated it's still, but uh, I think it should uh, be close to a draw. Mm. Did you start thinking about winning the game here already, or did you think you were nope. fighting for a draw? No, but it was very unclear. Um, on, a, on a short time, it's really hard to say who is doing better here. Uh, I thought that probably white should not be worse. I mean, uh, somehow 
it should be all okay for weight, but uh, both short on time, anything can happen. D4, let's make it to the time control. E6, E6 was a very yes, strange yes, decision. Yes, uh, yes, I was as well. I was completely shocked when he played E6. Um, it's a very strange decision. Yeah, I think uh, rook C7 right. should have been uh, clearly the move. Yeah. And now take, take, uh, D3, D3, King of 1. Now I have a couple of choices. Um, well, probably so knight like D4. Or like in the game. Uh, yes, but now the difference is King E1, knight take B5 and bishop D6. Oh. I th maybe I'm doing just very bad here. Because I'm just one tempo, not in time, with my king. I think it's just uh, well, maybe I, maybe I have some drawing chances, but uh, no more. Yeah? Black is fighting for a draw. Yeah, it's looking bad. Probably, wow, it's so probably it's lost. Yeah. That was a real shocking move. Uh, yeah. Yes, but uh, maybe. Um, he was a little bit afraid of king g6 uh, in the beginning. I mean, uh, yeah. yes, after rook c7. First, I thought black is uh, it's okay after take, take. d3, king f1, king g6. I was trying to win a tempo. But I think now after a4, uh, I'm just not in time. King f5, and now this uh, bishop b8 move. Yeah. Mm. Uh -huh. I mean, it was hard to, call to say immediately during the game because a lot of tricks still, but. Uh, I think white is probably winning. A lot of calculating in that game. You must be kind of tired of all these lines. It's quite impressive. That's quite. Uh, so e6, of course, was just a blunder. Um. <coughs> what did he think? What's the advantage of him no given idea. that pawn up? No, I don't know. We thought he must have missed the move knight d4. Here. Yeah, probably. Probably, yeah. And and the rest was just good technique. Uh, Maybe as well he just blundered that he can go bishop d6 after knight b5 before playing a6, yeah. That's ah, why right. he uh, wanted, yeah. but, but okay, it's hard to say. I mean, of course, it's just a blunder. So yeah. I think uh, after knight d4 position is just uh, close to lost. Uh, yeah. He was as well quite unlucky. He's just one tempo not in time to make a draw. Um, yes, I think this is all forced. You can't take on can't a7 take because knight c4, c4. Yeah, yeah. it's just uh, over. So king d2, a5, king d3, king g6. Now he was quite unlucky not to be able to play king c3. Because king f5, king b3, knight b5, king c4. Looks like a draw, but now I think I have a4. Oh, and take a3. E5. Yeah, bishop a7, e5. Uh, that's, yeah, so. that's very nice. Beautiful. Yeah, that's winning. Yeah. See, it's in the game, but now it's just winning, right? Did you? Uh, yes, I think now it's just winning, yes. I saw no hopes anymore here. In case of king d4, I can, I think, just go uh, knight b6, king e5, knight d5, and king f7, so I'm covering the boss pawn. So uh, I think this, sh this should be winning somehow. I need to get now my knight to somewhere, I don't know, c2 or somewhere, but I think... Uh, I mean, from the feeling it should be winning now. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Let's briefly see the game. F3. This is the only winning move, right? Uh, E5. At I, least. Don't, I, I don't know if it's the only one, uh, but uh, it's the most easiest. <laughs> okay, fair enough. <laughs> no, E5 is a good one. Because I think now after King G5, uh, yes, first check, of course, and uh, yeah. I think King G5 is just important. Mm, I think good. now there are no more hopes. Uh, because basically he's, he needs to take and I'm um, getting this e4 and king, yeah. king take g4 mm -hmm. after which uh, I think it's already winning. Yeah, and the rest was uh, straightforward. So Germany yeah. won the match two and a half, one and a half against Norway. Just as we predicted, we said Nidic will beat Carlsen with black on board one, the other guys will make draws two Did and a half. I no think like we did predict two and a half, one and a half, right? But we, we, might have, we, yeah, haven't, we didn't we predict Nidic win with black today, but uh, yeah. what a great result anyway. Um, we have a tweet from Steve O'Connor. When was the last time both world champions lost on the same day? Oh, that's a very good mm -hmm. question. How you found also Jos lost today to Katarina Latno? So. That's one for the trivia. I have Wouldn't no know. idea. Anyway, uh, congratulations, a great result. That means Thank that you. Germany 
you know. We're still fighting. You're really We're still fighting. fighting. Yeah. Yeah. You had a great result against the English, you know, holding us to a draw. Wow, <laughs> we were not too happy <laughs> with, the, <laughs> with the draw. But, uh, um, yeah. but tomorrow you're going to have a, a, a tough match. You might even play one of the big guys tomorrow, right? So. Oh, but I think uh, yeah, as well today was a very tough match already for us. Trying uh, to scare him after he played Carlson with Black <laughs> <laughs> How big can guys. he be scared? scared. <laughs> I meant as the team. I meant the team. Um, but no, congratulations. A, a fantastic Thanks. win. And uh, good luck, really. You've had a long day, so we'll let you we'll let you go. But uh, thanks for yeah. coming up and okay. showing us again. Yeah, welcome. Okay, thanks, thanks Arkady. Have a good day. Okay. So Arkady Nadic there showing us how to beat the world champion. I wouldn't have won that. Neither would Jan. I don't think I would have won the ending. <laughs> no, I don't like think it would have won the matter ending. Matter of technique, uh, I'm not so sure. That's just an, an outstanding result. Let's go through the results.